was. It sure did. Tyler Scott. Scott isn't fooled here by the read option. Knocks the ball out of Miller's hands and then recovers the ball himself. Wildcats making plays early, forcing the turnover. The ensuing drive in Northwestern, we tell straight. Starting QB, King Coulter lines up in the slot. And Trevor Simeon hits Coulter over the middle for the TD. 7-3 Northwestern, Coulter's first receiving touchdown of the year, fourth of his career. Late in the first, same score, Northwestern punting. Buckeyes break through, they block it, and they recover it for a touchdown. And the Buckeyes are up 10-7, talk about making plays. Second quarter off play action, Simeon rolling out, hitting Christian Jones. 25-yard gain, Wildcats inside the Buckeye 20. Later in the drive, first and goal, Coulter, so cool, keeps it on the option, and he just simply dives in for the touchdown. Northwestern leading 14 to 10. End of the first half, Ohio State down seven. If Adio Dinobu buys his way back to Miller and deflects the pass, and Chichi Aaron Guzzo comes down with a pick, Northwestern up seven at the half. Third quarter, Buckeyes down by 10. First and goal, Miller up the middle, uh-oh. Coughs it up, Northwestern recovers. How's Urban Meyer feeling right about now? Uh, get a look at his face. It's coming, it's coming, wait for it. Oh, there it is, he's frustrated. Northwestern punting after a three and out. CJ Bryant runs into Philly Brown as he tries to catch the kick. That's interference, that was the call. Ohio State takes over at the Northwestern 36. Ensuing drive, second and goal, Carlos Hyde. Buckeyes now down by just three. Fourth quarter, same score. Issues for Simeon because his pass is picked off by Duran Grant. And in the ensuing drive, third and goal from the two, Carlos Hyde. Get out of his way. He just clears space and he's ruled down there. The play would have to be reviewed. Take another look. I've got the ball across the goal line for the touchdown and that was huge. Put the Buckeyes up by four. Yes. Ensuing Northwestern drive, Simeon hitting Rashad Lawrence. Lawrence! And he's going to end up inside the 10. Don't you love how Northwestern didn't just, you know, roll really? up in a corner and high? Now third and goal, Simeon steps up in the pocket. Hits Cameron Dickerson now for the touchdown. Look at this play. Head up, found Dickerson, touchdown. Wildcats on top by three. Over five minutes to go now. Buckeyes first and goal. Miller hands off to who else? Wouldn't you hand off to Carlos Hyde? Ohio State up 34 to 30. Fourth and one now, under three to go. Northwestern trying to get the first down. Wow, they were stopped. Take a look at the replay. The problem, Coulter, he fumbled the snap. Oh my goodness, let's look at it at another angle from above this time. Oh, uh, I, uh, is it the right call? So look where it's, Time out for measurement. Well, let's see. Northwest would get one more chance to pull off a miracle. So let's try the whole lateral thing. We always have fun watching it. The people, oh yeah, that didn't really last long, did it? Eventually the Buckeyes wow. fall on it, so it's a touchdown. So the final score is really deceptive because what a game this was. Wow. You can just tell the look of the faces on the two head coaches. What a battle, 40 to 30. The Buckeyes escape. Braxton Miller, 15 to 26, 203 yards. And that pick, Carlos Hyde, star of the game for Ohio State. 168 yards rushing, three touchdowns. Unbelievable. Let's now take a look at the quest for perfection as Ohio State's remaining schedule looks like this. Iowa, Penn State, at Purdue, at Illinois, anything scary, at 19, Michigan.